In the midst of the endless blue waves, two sea giants are preparing to battle in an invisible arena, the USS Gerald R. Ford and the Fujian. Who is stronger? If you are a military enthusiast, you are already familiar with the USS Gerald R. Ford. This American aircraft carrier boasts advanced technology and unmatched combat power. The competition to be the strongest on the seas is growing fiercer. Recently, China has captured attention with the launch of the world's first unmanned aircraft carrier, named Fujian. This represents a significant leap in the military world, demonstrating China's intent to advance the use of unmanned aircraft in combat and reshape the global naval power landscape. The American aircraft carrier, long considered the strongest, may now face a new challenge. Who is currently leading the ocean? Let's dive deeper. The USS Gerald R. Ford stands as the future successor to the Enterprise and Nimitz-class carriers for the U.S. Navy. Since its launch on October 11, 2013, and entry into service on July 22, 2017, this vessel is the most advanced and lethal combat platform in the world. With the capacity to carry up to 90 aircraft and over 4,500 personnel, the USS Gerald R. Ford is a cornerstone in crisis response and decisive initial strikes in large-scale combat operations. It offers cutting-edge capabilities in maritime presence, deterrence, sea control, power projection, and humanitarian assistance. Fifth-generation F-35s, F-A-18 Super Hornets, MH-60 RS helicopters, and various UAVs all operate from this carrier, enhancing its presence at sea. With integrated stealth technology, the USS Gerald R. Ford is a prime target for China, which may view the vessel as a potential target for their missiles and hypersonic glide vehicles. However, in an effort to surpass the US, China is also preparing a new weapon, the Fujian, the world's first aircraft carrier specifically designed for unmanned aircraft. How will China's move impact America's dominance at sea? The Fujian, named after the Fujian province, is the third carrier in China's program and the first of the Type 003 class. Launched in June 2022, it replaces the Type 002 Shandong as the largest and most advanced carrier built outside the United States. The presence of the Fujian marks a significant advance in China's naval capabilities, underscoring its ambition to enhance its influence in the Indo-Pacific region. During its first sea trials in May, the Fujian showcased cutting-edge technologies such as an integrated propulsion system and electromagnetic catapults. While specific details about its carrying capacity have not been fully disclosed, Japan's 2023 Defense White Paper notes that the Fujian can accommodate between 60 to 70 aircraft, including J-15 fighter jets and KJ-600 early warning aircraft. This aircraft carrier clearly reflects China's ambition to stand out in the global military arena. When comparing the Ford to its predecessor, the Nimitz class, it's like a giant leap in innovation. The Ford-class carrier, being the most modern in the United States, represents a striking transformation. While the Nimitz-class relied on steam catapults, the Ford now employs the more advanced and efficient electromagnetic aircraft launch system. For landings, the Nimitz used the MK-7 aircraft recovery system, but the Ford has switched to advanced arresting gear, which can handle a variety of aircraft with less maintenance. All these differences highlight significant technological advancements. In China, the evolution of aircraft carriers reflects a dramatic transition from one era to the next. The Shandong, although a major achievement in its time, feels like a page from an old chapter. With its steam catapults and conventional deck design, the Shandong represented progress, but was still bound by traditional technologies inherited from the previous era. However, with the advent of Fujian, 
everything has changed. It features a futuristic flat deck design and cutting edge electromagnetic aircraft launch system. This carrier not only reflects advancements in technology, but also symbolizes China's ambition and innovation. The differences from previous carriers prompt it to rival other carriers in the vast seas. Two magnificent aircraft carriers compete for supremacy on the oceans. On one side, there's the USS Gerald R. Ford, an American carrier that has proven its capabilities since its launch in 2017. On the other side is China's latest carrier, the Fujian, which ventured into the oceans in 2022 and is still in the early stages of testing. The USS Gerald R. Ford, weighing 100,000 tons, is no ordinary carrier. Since its arrival, it has been involved in various significant operations, ranging from multinational exercises to stringent surveillance missions in the Mediterranean Sea and even operations in the Red Sea. This vessel serves as a fortress preventing potential conflict escalation and showcasing the American Navy's presence around the globe. On the other hand, the Fujian, while newly launched and expected to be a new milestone in China's naval power, still carries many mysteries. Weighing around 80,000 tons, the Fujian is indeed larger than China's previous carriers. However, its size still falls short when compared to the USS Gerald R. Ford. This affects the carrier's capacity to accommodate aircraft and other resources. Don't be quick to dismiss Fujian as a trivial competitor. The technology aboard is highly advanced. It is equipped with the same electromagnetic catapult system as the USS Gerald R. Ford, offering more efficient aircraft launches. However, the American carrier holds a strategic advantage with its nuclear power, providing greater endurance and operational range. The Fujian, on the other hand, still relies on conventional propulsion. Despite this, it is still more advanced compared to China's previous generation carriers. China, despite having operated aircraft carriers for only a few years, has made a smart move by choosing an electromagnetic catapult system similar to that on the USS Gerald R. Ford. However, since the US is the only country that has fully mastered this technology, China faces a significant challenge in perfecting it. Both the USS Gerald R. Ford and the Fujian play crucial and strategic roles for their respective countries. Over time, we will see how these ships make their mark in the history of global naval power. With ongoing advancements, will China be able to catch up with the US? Leave your thoughts and thanks for watching.